had a chance to work on the F-14 a little bit last night. What I've got done so far uh, today is just mocking up the, the main landing gear, trying to get an idea of what I'm going to put in the airplane. We'll get a close-up shot in a second, but you can see, uh, we'll flip the switch here, the gear doors, and the rotating mains. And uh, we'll get a, like I said, we'll get a close-up shot here in a second. It's built around a, uh, a retract uh, that I ordered in here the last couple of days that does rotate itself, so we didn't have to modify anything there. Just added a couple of linkages that should help take pressure off of the main when it's landing. And uh, just get, basically getting my uh, measurements and everything so that when I go and build the actual landing gear for the bird, uh, you know, we're going to be using functional oleo struts, the big tires, and once we actually you know, measure everything and put it in there, hopefully it'll fit and it'll all work just as smoothly as it does out here. We'll get a shot of it working with the uh, landing gear in the appropriate position here. Pull you over here. There we go. Nice enough. These, rotate, these retracts need a little bit of adjustment to actually rotate up the full 90 degrees. Uh, I can actually see where it, it wasn't machined perfectly, but to be honest, if it gets that close, it'll, uh, it'll sit underneath the door for this F-14 and it'll be, it should be just fine. So. Of course, I've sat here for about half an hour just watching the gear go up and down. I think it should hold up pretty well, so we'll get you guys a close shot. Okay, here's a close-up shot. You can see we've got, uh, there's that retract. Just used some uh, aluminum tube that I had handy and just a Depron wheel just glued on there for, uh, for the size. I'm actually going about 15% larger than what would be scale for the 1 9 um, So that's about a 4 something inch uh, wheel. Uh, reason being that I want to make sure, since I'm going pusher prop, I want to make sure that I'm going to clear the ground. You can see the linkages here, right now they're just made out of uh, threaded rod and, uh, and just the little ball link connectors. Um, the whole, I, I will probably do basically the same thing, maybe put some carbon fiber, decorate them up a little bit so they look a little bit cooler, but uh, this is the idea. We're just going to have this main linkage here that runs back and will connect into the fuselage. And uh, obviously the, the air front of the airplane is that direction so that as it's landing, these will actually pull tight and keep the uh, landing gear strut from bending backward. And like I said in the uh, beginning, we're going to be using functional oleo struts from Robart, um, just uh, very similar to the ones that I put in the, in the front. They won't be scale width, but they should look pretty good. So let's hit the, uh, let's hit the switch here.